As much as I knew about this subject, as much as I've read about it, as I've delved into it, as I've talked to people, today actually shocked me. It really did, and I, and I thought I was beyond that. I have, up until this moment, said the biggest problem is that the governor has created an atmosphere at the Port Authority that enabled people like David Wildstein to believe that he could just do this and then enable people like Bill Baroni, with whom I served in the state Senate, to come forth with a made-up cover-up. And then I find out that the governor has actually created that atmosphere in his own office, where people who report to him think it's okay to say, let's create some traffic in Fort Lee. To me, as I said, this is still a little shocking. And I am waiting, and hopefully with the leadership of Assemblyman Wisniewski, that this subpoena power will continue and that eventually, hopefully sooner rather than later, it's been four months, sooner rather than later, we will hear the whole story of who knew what when and it will be the end of this kind of an atmosphere in the state of New Jersey. To think that the mayor of one of the communities that I represent has been referred to in, it's hard to tell by words in an email whether they're meant to be demeaning, but to think up, he happens to be of Croatian background, by the way, and he's referred to in the emails as the Serbian, representing Serbia, well, maybe that's the way they look at government. But where I come from, Fort Lee is a democracy, Bergen County is a democracy, and so is New Jersey. Thank you.